Only a few days after pleading with North Korean ladies to bear more children, Kim Jong-un has introduced his own line of low-calorie beer in an attempt to aid with weight loss. Weight-conscious citizens are demanding light beer, and the diluted despot's state-run brewery is trying to meet this demand as thousands of families have revealed they are starving to death under his control. The Sun states that Chosen Sinbo, an outlet with strong ties to the state, claims that their new tea Dongang beer will have low sugar content and calories and is very effective for sports enthusiasts and persons with overweight bodies. The 2001 founded brewery uses an English brewery that was once located in Wiltshire but was dismantled and rebuilt in Pyongyang to produce the health-conscious beverage. There is a vocal demand for a beer that can avoid men putting on weight in North Korea. Rowan Beard, tour manager at Young Pioneer Excursions, which specializes in low-cost excursions to North Korea, told NK News. Soju, a distilled rice alcohol, is the national beverage, but North Korean men reportedly receive tokens for two liters of beer each month, according to the outlet. This is the brewery's seventh beer variety. Its products have previously been sold to South Korea and China. It occurs only a few days after the dictatorial leader made an apparent highly staged emotional plea in front of thousands of women assembled at a national mother's meeting in Pyongyang on Sunday. During the speech, he was spotted wiping his emotions with a handkerchief. At the event, Kim urged moms to instill the principles of his Communist Party in their children and stated, all of our housekeeping duties we need to handle while working with mothers is preventing a decline in birth rates and providing good child care. Many of the numerous ladies in the crowd, who were clad in traditional, multicolored clothing, sobbed aloud behind their leader. It wasn't entirely a somber event, though. Images from North Korea's official media also showed the enthusiastic audience applause and clapping for Kim as he waved back from his chair. Kim was surrounded by male officials wearing military uniforms and suits. The first national mother's meeting in 11 years was held in response to a decline in the birth rate in the isolationist state, which has clearly alarmed top DPRK, Democratic People's Republic of Korea, leaders. Kim addressed the crowd as dear mothers, saying, Our mothers should join us to tackle the host of social tasks that we are confronted with. The thinning plan is being implemented concurrently with reports from people who are imprisoned within North Korea that they have witnessed moms who were ill and unable to work starve to death before their offspring met the same inn. They claim that Kim has clamped down on anyone caught bringing food into North Korea to sell at markets or going near the border in an attempt to regain more control over his civilian population by using the COVID-19 outbreak. Those who are detected even in the act of crossing the border are executed by shooting as part of state execution. Witnesses claim to have seen four persons lined up at once and then shot mercilessly. North Koreans claim that only an invasion of their nation will put an end to their suffering since they have grown so hopeless after witnessing the hunger of their neighbors and chillin'.